welcome back to my channel today i am doing a lock detox as you can tell by the title um it's about time i do another detox my first and last detox was when i hit my first year mark and as you can see i am long overdue for one this is all lint build up from scarves shirts all that good stuff it's like look at this it just looks crazy so I'm just showing y'all what it looks like right now. And before I even do the detox, I'm gonna try my best to get as much lint out as I can by using this crochet needle. And I'm just gonna be picking at the lint as much as I can and making it come out of the lock. And while it's coming out, I'm gonna be pulling it with my fingers just to like pull as much out as I can, so. Here's an up close of what it's looking like. So yeah, I'm just picking at the lint. And yeah, viewer discretion is advised. This might look nasty or whatever, but it's literally just lint. It's not even product. Um, but yeah, I just felt that I would like to get as much lint out as I can before I even attempt the detox because I just feel like immediately doing the detox wouldn't be helping at all. So yes, y'all. So just continue watching of me trying to get this lint out of my locks. I still got no fumbles. I'm on a hot 100. Numero uno. This one ain't going a bundle. I'm in the wind. A million in chocolate chips. And that's your time I'm cooking crumble. I put a skirt on the whip and a crown on the six, but there's no need to dress up the numbers. Hey, hey. Yeah, but I can think of petty reasons. They want to know how I'm living my day to day life in the regular season. Well, some of all I did was rest, okay? And we thought I did was stretch, okay? If I was out there, I had sex, okay? We'll see what's about to happen next, okay? Okay. Okay, we'll see what's about to happen next, okay? Okay, okay, we'll see what's about to happen. Hey, hey, we'll see what's about to happen. Hey, we'll see what's about to happen. Now it might look like I'm messing up my lock and like pulling out my hairs, but all I would need to do really is just crochet that hair right back in. But I have to do what I have to do to get this lint out. Um, I really meant to bring my tweezers with me, but I forgot. So the crochet needle was just my best bet, but it's, it was really helping. It was working. It was really getting in there. So the hair is being pulled out. It's not a big deal. Trust me. Like I don't even really be caring when it comes to stuff like that. But yes, y'all, so just keep on watching. Well, summer all I did was rest, okay? And New Year's all I did was stretch, okay? And Valentine's Day I had sex, okay? We'll see what's about to happen next, okay? Okay, okay, we'll see what's about to happen next, okay? Okay, okay, we'll see what's about to happen next. Okay, y'all, so at this point, I was kind of over it. I was working on trying to get this lint out for the last hour and a half. And so I just felt like I got enough out as I could. Right here, I'm just looking through my locks and just seeing, like, what it's looking like, how much lint that I get out. But, yeah, at this point, I was like, girl, I'm ready to start because I already knew it was going to be... I was going to take all day to do my hair anyway. So, yeah, just showing y'all my hair, what it's looking like before I start this detox. The products for the detox, y'all already know. Some vinegar, apple cider, got all of these products from H-E-B, some lemon juice, and some baking soda. And so this little blow up basket thingy, I don't even know what to call it. I got it from Amazon, y'all. When I first started doing hair, I thought I was gonna need it, but I literally never used it, so it's just been at my house. But I'm gonna be using it today for me. So I'm just gonna fill it up with some water, fill it up with the apple cider vinegar, uh, the lemon juice and the baking soda and just make this little mixture and get it ready for my locks. Okay, so now I'm laying back, getting comfortable, trying to get my locks all in there. I'm not going to lie, y'all. It was a little hard. Um, just imagine trying to record a YouTube video and trying to do your own lock detox by yourself. Like, it was it was a lot of work, but I got it done. 
um with this little bottle i got from the beauty supply i just filled it up with apple cider vinegar and lemon and i used that to like really get in my roots and get into my hairline and the locks at the front because sometimes i tend to miss the front when i'm doing my own lock detox so i was like let me use this to try to make sure everything is fully saturated so yeah i really thought that was a good tip and a good idea of me to use and then right here i was just making sure my locks were fully saturated just swooshing it all around in the mixture just getting it all you know saturated and once i got everything situated i sat here for 45 minutes and i just let them soak So once I was done, I just wanted to show y'all the water, what it looked like after. And now I'm about to wash my hair. Um, I do look a little uncomfortable. I kind of was, but you know, I had to do what I had to do. But um, I'm just washing out that smell out of my hair because I really cannot stand the smell of apple cider vinegar. But I'm just washing it out with warm water and I'm going in with this rosemary and mint shampoo. I use this shampoo as a clarifying shampoo. It really makes my scalp tingle and it just gets out all the buildup and the extra whatever else was left in my locks. And yeah, and it also smells so good. So yeah, this is the first wash that I'm doing. After the clarifying shampoo, I use a hydrating shampoo and I really, really love this shampoo. Like I really stand by this shampoo. It smells so good. It lathers so good and it's super soft in your hands. Like you can feel the softness and it's affordable. Like if you already know ORS, like that's the old school brand. Like you can never go wrong with old school brand. But yeah, I'm just getting all of my locks from the root to the tip, making sure I'm trying to get that smell out of there because I do not like that apple cider vinegar smell. Y'all was jamming to some song, I can't even remember. But um, yeah, so now I'm just washing out all of the shampoo. I feel like my locks look so clean now. Like, I don't know, it just looks so clean and healthy. And yeah, so I'm just washing it all out. I'm making a change today. The lift have been taking the pain away. I heard you was giving your chain away. That's kind of like giving your fame away. What's wrong with you? I sit in a box where the owners do. A boss is a road that I've grown it to. I love you to death, but I told you the truth. I... Hey. Yeah, I got one lawyer, got one in that day, the only two, man. How many times have I told you the truth, man? How many nights I've been woke, swerving them potholes, not trying to fuck up the wheels, or fuck up the deals, I'm posted to stock, home, it's me the house and the twins, it's only the real. I'm moving way too humble, easy and handed it off, I still got no fumbles, I'm on a hot 100, numero uno, this one ain't come with a bundle, I'm in the wind, a million in chocolate chips, and that's your time I cookie crumble, I put a skirt on the whip and a crown on the six, but there's no need to dress up the numbers, hey, hey. All right, so this is what my hair is looking like after the two-step wash. I'm going to give you guys a side-by-side -side just to show y'all what it's looking like. And as you can see, I got a lot of that lint out. There is just a little bit left, but I mean, that's pretty normal. But I really did get a lot out of that's the goal of what I was trying to do. And yeah, it just looks way better. It looks way cleaner. Here's another side by side. You can definitely tell the difference. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really happy with the results and how my hair is looking now. 
So to add back even more hydration, I'm gonna be using this hydrating mist that I have been curating for a good while now. This is really the only product that I use when I wanna add back hydration or just to freshen up my locks. I love this product, coming soon. And then I'm gonna be using this lemongrass and eucalyptus oil. This is my first ever product and the response has been great. It sold out about a good three times um, and it smells so good. My clients and customers, they all love this. So if you guys are interested in purchasing, the link will be in the bio. So yes, support your girl if you love me. But yes, yeah, so I'm going to only be using these two products just to add back some hydration into my hair and just to freshen it up after that apple cider vinegar smell. So yes, y'all. So this is pretty much the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and learned how to do your own detox at home. All the products will be linked in the description. All my social media will be linked in the description. Make sure you guys follow and support me. But yes, you guys, I love you guys. And I'll see you in the next video. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all.